Hey the Pan friends, welcome to the channel again. Like always, it's me, your host Amy from Pan Venture, and I think we've overlooked to showcase the latest collaboration of ours uh, that was uh, recently announced on our website at the end of 2021 with a major international luxury riding instruments brand, Aurora Pen Company in Turin, Italy. Join me in this video, let me showcase some of the information regarding this brand and also I'm gonna show you some of their uh, most interesting models that we have in stock at this very moment. It gives me great, great pleasure to stand in front of you guys and showcase uh, milestones like this whenever I succeed in collaboration with a major, major brand like Aurora. Aurora is a very, very important writing instruments manufacturer from Italy. It was established in 1919, so there isn't too many pen companies that can say that they have um, over 100 years in pen making and that uh, makes me feel very very important that I was able to succeed in having their lineup of writing instruments in our store. I'm humble about it and thankful because uh, this couldn't be possible uh, without having the help of uh, the persons in charge at Aurora and also in the last three years we came a lot in the regards of uh, what we do have as a platform to offer to such important pen manufacturers. I can't wait to have a visit in Turin. I was invited by Aurora to visit their HQ and uh, trust me, I will try to bring my camera with me and uh, document such an experience because I know that they have a writing museum a writing instruments museum, a lot of things and uh, location is pretty, pretty impressive. Now, let me tell you a few of the models of writing instruments. They are well known for their 88 model of writing instruments and Optima. And also they do offer some high-end uh, limited editions with different models in their lineup. They have uh, some famous models like the anniversary models and you can find them all over. One of the first anniversary models that captured my imagination and uh, made me look into having an Aurora fountain pen was the 85th anniversary model which we have it right there and I'm going to show you that fountain pen in a second. Let's proceed and showcase some of the fountain pens that we have in stock and I enjoy having a little bit of everything when we start a new collaboration with a brand of fountain pens because this establishes a very good point where to start with the nib sizes and something unique about Aurora they are very um, elegant fountain pens they are not super big and oversized although some of them may uh, enter in the oversized uh, territory, but most of them are, um, let's say, medium size, medium weight, very elegant, very playful in regards of color. They have a very extended use of materials like resin, which uh, they call Auroloid. It's their in-house trademark material. And also they do have an extended use of uh, silver, and uh, they do have a feature like, uh, for example, that uh, blob of ink that you can use the last droplet of ink in the filling system if you run out of ink. With an Aurora, you can uh, access the last droplet of ink and go through the page and uh, you know that you pretty much need to fill up the fountain pen next time you get to uh, close to a ink bottle. Uh, regarding their nibs, all of their nibs are made in-house from 14 karat gold and 18 karat gold. They have a pretty famous nib uh, meister there which does amazing stuff with nibs. I do have one of his creations, the gotcha nib, which is an, um, let's say, specialty nib to say so which offers the user a different line with 
um, if you vary the angle upon uh, that you use to write with the fountain pen. So that is pretty, pretty impressive. And we will get to that maybe in a writing sample in the video review of that exact fountain pen that I own in my personal fountain pen collection. To give you a bit of uh, perspective regarding uh, the writing experience with an Aurora fountain pen, I would say that they have been very consistent and also very much alike, like a Japanese nibs. So for example, if you want a finer line with a hint of a feedback and medium flow, Aurora nib is something that you need to look into because that is exactly what's available from Aurora in regards of their nibs. Their nibs are presented in a few sizes, uh, extra fine, fine, medium, broad, stub, italic. We will try uh, on the go to include their lineup of gotcha nibs, which are the exclusive uh, in-house uh, made specialty nib by their uh, nibmeister uh, that I told you with the gradient uh, angle of writing and the different width in lines. Let's proceed and showcase. One of the first models that I want to show you is the Aurora Optima Flux. This is a 14 karat gold nib, which is flexible only one size fine and I did order a few of their uh, colors for the Optima line. We have red, yellow, orange, two others that I really enjoyed. And this is a navy blue and a very interesting green. Pretty much this is the fountain pens that are available in stock at PenVenture at this moment from the Optima line and I cannot wait to showcase one of these fountain pens in a video review soon on our channel. We have a beautiful, beautiful Optima in the purple Auraloid and with the rose gold plated trims. This is offered with 14 karat gold nib and it is a stunning, stunning looking fountain pen. Quite easy to clean and I'm gonna show you how easy it is. For example, this is a screw in nib unit. This is how easy it is to remove it. So it will keep your tines aligned. There isn't any, uh, for example, force to unscrew the nib and to risk damaging the nib. So this is very nice because you can clean them quite easy. Now I'm gonna show you a variation of the Optima line in a demonstrator material. So take a quick look at this and uh, see how elegant is this complete demonstrator fountain pen. This beautiful Optima that you can see the inner works of the piston filling mechanism. The nib sits very, very nicely on the ebonite feed in there. Everything is see-through and I love this model. I really, really love it. Moving further, I'm gonna show you two of their fountain pens from the Dante Alighieri collection. Inferno, which is this beautiful black. This is a unique model dedicated to this series. And we have the Purgatory, which is blue, this navy blue with the Italian flag. Everything is made in silver in regards of trims and uh, 18 karat gold nibs. This is very, very nicely showcased. And there is another fountain pen, which is the Paradise. And we are waiting for that to arrive in stock really soon. 2021 marked 700 years since uh, the passing of Dante Alighieri. So this is why most of the pen manufacturers from Italy address the theme of the Divina Comedy. And everyone had their own way of interpreting that uh, amazing uh, literature work of Dante Alighieri. Now I want to show you the model that uh, drew me to Aurora. We have the 85th anniversary and take a look how beautiful is this fountain pen. I am really really happy that I could secure a piece like this in our inventory and possibly another one is coming on the way here. It will be so hard to contain myself not to have one of these fountain pens in my private collection and I'll probably gave into this 
and will have one in my personal fountain pen collection. This is made with a silver section and the silver section shows this beautiful patina in aging and it's just amazing to say at least. Same piston filling mechanism, beautiful, beautiful fountain pen and the nib is spectacular. And uh, now let me get to the 100 years anniversary model, which I think it's a splendid fountain pen model from Aurora. And I did went further and order another one to have in stock because uh, this one, again, I wanted for myself to have one. So we have here the 100 years anniversary model. Tell me which is another pen manufacturer or there are so many pen manufacturers that can say that they have 100 years under their own belt of pen making. I don't think so. There aren't too many. This is a beautiful silver pen, quite heavy. It's enameled and you can see the play of colors in this beautiful, beautiful enamel. Everything is made in silver, 18 karat gold nib from Aurora 750 and it is a stunning, stunning work and uh, this is one of the fountain pens that I really, really enjoy and uh, will have one in my private collection for sure and I will let you know when is that time. You can check my playlist of my personal collection updates and whenever I will decide to add this fountain pen in my private collection, you will find a video there. So pretty much this is the core of our uh, selection for Aurora. From here, we will add newer and newer models every time that uh, they will be launched by Aurora. Down below, I will leave you the link to our collection selection for the Aurora brand, you can search there and see some of the fountain pens that I've showed you right here. And uh, I'm really happy that uh, we was able to secure a connection and partnership with Aurora. I'm humble and thankful for that. And I look forward at what's going to come from Aurora. And um, of course, visiting them in Turin in Italy. Don't forget if you want to see how uh, some of the nibs of Aurora are made in-house and writing instruments, you just need to search in YouTube how it's made and type fountain pen. So how it's made, how a fountain pen is made and search for the video from uh, the show on uh, Discovery Channel, how it's made because they filmed at Aurora in Italy. Pretty much take it from there and you will see how interesting is their lineup of writing instruments. Thank you for spending this time with me on the Penventure YouTube channel. I hope you enjoyed my content. Don't forget to share your opinion and suggestions in the comment section down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know also which is the brand that you want to uh, find on the Penventure website. And uh, I will uh, look forward at 2022 to partnership with new pen manufacturers that will be showcased in our inventory. Don't forget to uh, support my passion and uh, my adventure in the fountain pen world. And if you enjoy my content, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. This will help me a lot with the YouTube algorithm. I know that some of you guys that are watching my videos are not subscribed yet. So if you want to subscribe, you can do that. You just need to click here on this button and turn the notification bell on. And if you want to see more quality content from Penventure and myself, you have this video right here. Click and enjoy. My name is Emi and I look forward to seeing you next video. Take care, stay safe, bye-bye.